Hello and welcome back to Master Chalice. If you're still not listening to the mad, the mad uh, yes. Uh, if I'm right about this, we should actually have a mouse cursor this time. So that's nice. Alright, let's go and save that young level 1 male alchemist. Of course, we're bringing checkup. Oh, these two need to level up a little, don't they? Yeah, just, just grab that. You, get your free flask. Well, it's not a free flask. It's just that you can throw it without, you know, paying any additional prices. Also, we're bringing Aqua. Oh, Steven is also old enough now. What's his stats? Hard the Queen, make a rebel reveler. That's not at all a bad combination, I think, maybe. Okay, you unlock your stealth move. Let's see what else we do. Tell me more about the stats. Often drunk or hungover. Ah. Increased maximum uh, hit points might be good, though. Yeah. We're bringing egg Nakba right now. So. Maybe just let Jacob. Yeah, we're not gonna get much out of Jacob anyway. He's old. There isn't much we can do with him these days. So let's bring Steven as well. And then. Oh, we have a hunter. Yeah. Let's bring a hunter. I thought this was the younger one, but it isn't at all. So let's bring Alessandre. Wait, 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 wait. Matthew, do you have better stats? How can we bring in Matthew? Wait, was it Matthew with us before? I don't even know. No, probably not. Everyone who were with us before died. Because I'm just that bad at the game. You, but I'm ready to hit something today. Seriously. The first thing we see, ruptures. Ruptures everywhere. Alright, uh. But we can't stealth move with this, so. Try to follow up. And that's one down. But this guy, he doesn't even have a follow up skill. Uh. Okay, can you move over there? You can. Can you throw it over there? You can. Approximately. That is a free throw. That you should still have actions. Yeah, you do. Okay, let's try and get this archer over here to see if we can level up him. Nope. Which of course means that the alchemist gets all the pleasure. All of it. Which will be a problem later on. Nope, it will be a problem instantly. Uh, Steven, can you do this as a sprint? Nope. Too far away, Aqua. Okay, you can take it. Oh, well, someone killed the seed. Yeah, we need to get Aqua out of that corrosion as soon as possible. I guess we can start moving on now. Stealth moving would be advisable, I believe. Oh, the corrosion damage isn't that bad. Huh. That's surprising. Okay. More options and seeds over in that direction. I think we'll move in that direction first and then check over the bridge. And just maybe. Just maybe do Valhalla. Where Odin may or may not be waiting for us. Poor alchemist. No stealth for him. Just a direct sprint. Okay, where can you hide? Well, we can't send him into that corrosive shit, so yeah. This guy that places us this way. Did the seed see someone? Uh, no, apparently not. Okay, we could get a kill from that, but on the other hand. If we bring the archers closer, they may be of help. Hmm. 
I need you closer as well, sir. I wonder if we could get a... Stealth Alchemist house. That sounds like fun. Alright, Alchemist. Move as close as you can. But that may require us to kill the seed. We'll look into that later. Get the kids over here. Right. Uh, yeah, the rupture... The rupture will be... Okay, I just basically sacrificed the... Alchemist by accident. Yep. Yep, that wasn't my plan. On the other hand... Can, I, can you get a kill? No! Only a classic blue. Uh, that's disappointing. Can you kill the rupture? No, you just miss. It's dead. Completely. You? Can you do a follow-up kill? Nope. You also miss completely. Which means the rupture probably explodes. Because we have to kill the seeds so our alchemist does not die. Yeah, not very good at this. And of course now this group is together. And the rupture is going for the Darcher. We say. Okay, these two will have to fall back. Like, that's enough for, out of them for this round. They'll die otherwise, and I have no wish for them to die. So, back off. Go on vacation. Whatever. But these guys will have to move on. We need to kill, kill more ruptures so I can get my. get these fellows some nice little. I think they were called. ramp caps? Something like that. Like really nifty tools. Yeah, you can just sit there as well. Well, you can simply just sit there. Alright. Uh, Archer, how far can you run? Over there. Same thing with interest. With stone faces. That's pretty cool. Okay, you can get over there. And I'm sure the second cable can get over here. Ah. Uh, And there's the rupture. I'm sorry kid, old man, whichever. I can't bring you with us. Too much at risk. Okay, can you stealth move over there? Can you see rupture from there? You see two ruptures, uh, that's a little bit less simple to handle. Your accuracy leaves to be wished. Well, boop. Let's just hope they don't notice that guy. And you're just gonna wait here. Yep, that instantly revealed that fellow as well. And that puts my archer at really poor health as well. I hate ruptures. Long story short. Really not a big fan. Uh, Alright, we need to move you out of the acid. 13 to 16 damage. No, that was really wishful thinking. Oh, and that wasn't enough to kill him either. Well, in that case, I'm not going to sacrifice another troop and just uh, let him take the blunt of that damage. Brunt even, is it? I don't know. But anyway, this seems to be the end of this round. And... What was her name again? Steven. Okay, Steven. Uh, none of these breaches are uh, functional, so we're gonna have to fall back a lot. Stealthing won't actually be required. There, why not? 
maybe, just maybe we can use the archers as scouts without getting them killed. I'll give it a try. Hmm. Where's the first cover on that side there? I didn't see any. Which may be a problem. Also, bring the flasks, just in case. And let's just hope we don't fuck up. Okay, I can't move you further from here, but... Uh, maybe. So that side over there is not part of the battle area, which means that everything should be in this corner here. And let's hope it's just seeds. Lots and lots of seeds. Okay, give me the next combatant. And next one. Run them over. I'm gonna let the archers take this bridge and try the lower bridge with the garbage axe, but that means, of course, moving them all down here. Uh, the alchemist will wait. Alright. You can still move over there. What do your archer eyes see? Hunter eyes? Nothing. Absolutely nothing. Okay. Cool. You just wait over there. You run. And Aqua? Run. Okay. Ephes, 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 Ephes. What are we gonna do with you? I guess we can start moving you slowly. Let me just locate some of the enemies. They're too far away to actually reach me this turn. He is not there. He might actually pose a threat if he... Oh. Well, that's two of them. Which goes... Well along with my... That may be a threat plan. Okay, can you shoot him? You can! And you missed the second shot. Not ideal. Okay, I want this guy to remain in stealth there. So... Get over there and see if there's anything else down here. Does it look like it? Okay. Bring the garbage in first. Uh, you don't have to actually... In okay, sure. If that's how you wanna run, that's how you run. And bring in this guy as well. I think you can go this far, but I don't think they can run this far. So we should be good. Sadly, the rupture did not aggro. Oh shit. And the plus side of that affair is the fact that uh, there is no real plus side, is there? Alright. You. Take the shot. You should have run. You should have run. Well, he won't make the same mistake. He will run. Won't get in t cover in time, though, I don't think. Wait, we can move first. Let's try just that. And then free throw. And then standardized throw. And that is one down. Of course, whatever that guy over there does gets me in trouble. Did you have knockback? I didn't know that was an ability you had. I could, you also have knockback. And I've been so worried about cables and ruptures and... Oh, for fuck's sake. This could have been a lot easier. Sadly, they are currently seen, so... Uh, still spotted. Still spotted, okay. Might as well just run down there. Let's see what we can get from this. The rupture is on the move. 
And that's one dead archer. God damn it. And that was my higher level one as well. Like legit bugger. Alright, can you throw this over there? No, you cannot. So that is most likely the alchemist as well. Cool. And that was a glancing. That was a glancing blow. Seriously. All right. Uh, let's see what we can do about this guy there. Oh, it's four to five damage there. And there was no actual knockback. The stunt though. So that does mean my alchemist isn't dead yet. Uh, can you get over there and see if you can line up a singular shot from there? Nope, too far away. Alright, then step move over there. For next turn. This should be the la Oh. More seeds. This should still be the last of them, though. Uh, okay, if you run... No, 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 that's still... Oh, what am I talking about? He's out of palms anyway. Alright. That was a glancing blow, seriously? Shit. Don't glancing blow this. Thank you. Now, let's just hope that Steven also survives. I could sacrifice him to achieve things, but... Uh, Let's not. Let's just keep him over here waiting for the perfect time to strike. Uh, is there any way where for you to stand that is not corrosive acid on this side? Nope, so just try over there. See if you can take that shot. Sorry, Steven. But this is probably safer. And you can do nothing. Okay. I would have preferred the classic blow, dude. Is it only the lapses that steal XP? Because I don't see him losing XP right now. Ah, gross in damage. What? Oh, no. Goodbye, Iron Hand. Oh, this is bad. Well, run away. Can you shoot one? Nope. Well, in that case, Aqua, get over there. And then... Make yourself sparse. We're gonna see about attacking them from... Behind. Which is problematic because we can't actually see them. But we can fix that by doing this. That was a miss. And that may be an issue. Well, this should work there. And this should go for the Gabba first, I think. Uh, can you? One from the acid. Why can't you attack him from this side? Dude. Like, why can't you do the option that doesn't get you killed? Maybe if I step you here first... Yeah, there we go. And that still gets you killed. Never mind. So that's a lot of losses this round. A lot. I think... I don't expect this to be a very long series. <laughs> but you know, I'm gonna have fun until it lasts. And then, of course, we may go... There was and some battle that ended just like this, right? Well, it wasn't exactly. There were no pawns obviously, but I believe you're referring to Holler's Rebellion. That's it. Oh, how could I forget the bees? The bees? Okay. Well, Aqua's still alive. Uh, I wanted to check on House Tarantino. And we got a new male alchemist as well. So this is that. Did you... <gasps> you did get a child! Lorelei, nearsighted, but quick. 
That's pretty pretty nifty. Not bad, not bad. We are going to research Hellfire soon. <sighs> oh, so defending this territory completely cleared the cadence from it, so that's a bonus. Where is this the reduced construction time? We are going to have to build something on there. I think keep. Because since we don't have any Sage Rite or Crucible bonuses, we are just gonna have to, you know, do things the old way of having those in the middle. Relax, it's not an attack. Or maybe you shouldn't relax. Alright, so Mitra Freya purchases for, for waking you, but this matter couldn't wait. It seems the marriage to Logar Ironhand has been going too well recently, and Mitra just doesn't see things working out for much longer. They're both in the capital of the day for a briefing on reaching statues. What do you do? Uh, talk with them. The sit down goes even better than you expected. It turns out that they were both just frustrated about being forced into this marriage. You understand, but speak eloquently about the importance of their duties, the gravity of the nation's situation, and how their union is one of the most important defenses we have in this war. By the end, they're holding hands again and actually looking happy to be with one another. Perhaps you should start charging with this. Well, I don't think that go. Can children inherit those traits? I don't think so. Alright, uh, the health files can now be used. Can I just bring those with me every time we go anywhere? There are really interesting items here. I will need to use this. But I don't know if I need to do this immediately. What's this? There are volumes of ancient texts about the chalice of these powers lying in the capital basement and we have good reason to believe that the translating them could lead to finding more experienced heroes. Alright, well, we're gonna need to build that keep over on the redux reduced uh, construction time because that is going to help us a lot. Of course, uh, we're probably not going to see that keep built this episode, but, you know, should be too much of a problem. Sound the horns of passing. So Logar has died. It's tough, but now you've got an idea of what to expect from this campaign. Lots of horns. The partner will return to your retinue, and you'll have to appoint a new regent and partner to continue the bloodline. Your heroes await your decision. River Lacqua. You only got one battle. There. Guess that happens. I want the shadow check. Which probably means going with Matthew. Knee sided longevity. Queen make a younger house flincher. Sure. I'm really low on actual people I can send into battles there. Oh, and Jacob died as well. That's probably why I couldn't set him down as the regent. Oh. Ooh. Well, I kind of want to go to guard this territory now because otherwise this will get like two points on it. Ruptures and pull box. Oh, seats and pull box. Mm. Uh. Well, we'll see about that next time, so thanks for watching, I'll see you then.